NES level 1 1, but it's all Goombas. <laughs> oh my god. I just thought about some of the things that could be turned into Goombas and how interesting it could be. I wonder if you did it everywhere, though. Oh my god. Yep, it's it's all Goombas. <laughs> Including all the pipes. I should use those two Goombas on the bottom though. This isn't bad though, like this isn't this isn't too hard. Oof. It is exactly what was on the label. It's funny too because there's. I didn't expect the entire floor to be gone, but that's like so much better. Wow! How did we thread that needle? There's Alley CP. I saw you playing my levels. I appreciate it too. I like when people play my levels. I have a contest going again. You can get some world records in my stages. You can win art. Some nice art. Oh yeah, the invisible block would have been a gigantic awkward thing. Nice. Seriously? Again? I can't seem to land that. Yeah, no freaking fun. We're going in hot. It's mime night. We had to go hard. We started early. And we're going till probably the regular time. make that sometimes. Some powerful art. Power fart. Huh. That's not what I call it, but, you know, you're Kanga. You're weird. You do stuff. Putty! Jesus. Talk that away to break your concentration. The little cat- Meow! Wow. He's acting like he's being tortured down there. We all know he's not. What most likely happened is my other cat, Zaraki, he probably jumped somewhere that he can't reach. And so he's crying because he wants to play. I have him right here. Treats for the cat, they're right here. They're in a green bag, so that didn't work out showing you, but... Invisible treats for the cat. Meru, what's going on, buddy? You having a good Maru day? I'm doing pretty good. Now, Kanga, there have been so many better things to clip tonight. That's just not even up there. It's not up there. It's 1-1, one, one, Maru, except it's all Goombas. Nothing but Goombas and Rails, which I was not advertised. It doesn't advertise this. No 1-1 one, one clip, that's true. It's not in the real Mario one either, though, as far as I know. Seriously, that part's the hardest. Like, getting over that uh, that gap and... There's only like three Goombas that represent the ground there. Ugh. And it's hard to tell which direction they're going in when you land on one on one platform. And you're, you're not really looking at the next platform because you have to watch so closely at what you're hitting. 
That is true. They could not have warned me better. I'm sure there is. I mean, every level like this probably has one. Like, if I wait a little extra at the beginning, this lines up pretty okay. Yeah, there would, there would definitely be multiple paths. It would just be like, which ones are fast? Ugh. I can't seem to get under that guy. And that time I didn't land on the guy. Stay higher on the map. Yeah, that's I've I've been trying to use the pipes because the pipes seem really nice. But that that pipe is a harder to hit than the other two. Even at full speed, unless you hit the uh, the second pipe at a high point. And sometimes that jump makes it, and sometimes it doesn't. God, this is really tough. That kind of worked. You just have to get past the obstacles. Sometimes I'm like positive there's gonna be a Goomba somewhere and then there's just none. I hit the A guy and there's like a hole in the ground where I wanted to jump. All those Goombas and I can't hit any of them on their heads Instead, I just freaking run into the side of one. God! <laughs> the acceleration of Mario in this game is just so weird. I will get used to it someday, I promise. But it's, you can't, like, backtrack at all. You can't wiggle backwards. You're, it's basically aerial ice physics compared to SMB3 and SMW. See right there, I was... Ugh. I was waiting for a Goomba to be near the left edge and they were just all too far away. I don't know, I was just missing the Goomba. It's, they're all so far away. Silsarino Magnifico. What's going on, buddy? How's your Silsa day? Tell us everything. I tried to land on that Goomba. I don't know what was up. I thought I was going to hit him, and then I just gently fell beside him. You have to follow the Goombas, because if you kill your hole in the ground, and you miss a Goomba, there's nowhere to go. Yeah, 
was kind of a long Thursday for me too, but now I'm on mime, so things happen. Ugh. I'm trying to get to the Goomba before he goes away. But they they move away from the left side of that platform so fast. Or maybe I'm going too fast myself. Yeah. Oh my lord. Holy cat baskets. There was nowhere to land. I couldn't make it to the other pipe. I didn't have enough speed. And the hole there, there was a really big gap that time. Still so. Silso, Salso. Imagine how hard he is to order in a restaurant. Almost get that confused all the time. Yeah, it was a solid attempt. It's, uh, once we get past the the gap there, there's like a really just weird gap that has a very hard alignment to me. But after that, it gets a lot easier. So there's that, which helps. It's tough to look at more than one row at a time. Like if you're jumping on the lower guys, it's hard to look up at the the higher ones. Which is probably why people like to go as high as possible in this level, but there's certain points where there's only Goombas in the lower section. Once I get a good case of the runs going, that's true. You just can't stop me. My runs have been solid. If you know what I mean. That's sometimes it's easier though. Less choices help players. That's the only reason Kaizo works at all. Kaizo works because people are tunnel vision so hard on the only solution that's possible. It makes it easier. Even though the tricks themselves are hard. Clipping what one? I don't even know what happened. I tried. Slowing down seems to help too. Just, uh, just go little by little. Boop. Beep, 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 beep. Damn. It's that one is really hard too because you have to get a lot of momentum to get to the gap, but then you have to avoid the, the big bounce. Because there's just not a lot of Goombas in that section. Ugh. Nintendiana Jones 64, what's going on? Thanks for the level. I really wish that more of those Goombas were moving left when you got to that platform. Because it's there's a lot of holes in there. Like a lot of the time. So I'm going to UPS tomorrow, Arabam, to send your package, and I'll send Haley Aran's prize at the same time. Cat baskets. I think a fifth Goomba would have been nice there.
Yeah, well this time I'm gonna make sure to try and classify it as a relatively high value item so that they don't have to question it. Like, I don't think that they'll question it if it's if I overvalue it. Ugh, see that gap is huge. It's so weird. It's huge, as Bernie Sanders would say. I want to get a new drink, because I'm like, just kind of sipping at this one now at the bottom of its usefulness. But I'm worried to go downstairs and get a new one. Somebody just like seeing me through the window in my front door. It's like, whoa, what does that guy do? Oh my god, how'd I miss that? They all just change directions at such a, a small hitbox. <sighs> see, I was gonna land on him, but he's at the box. You can't see under it. So you don't know exactly when he's gonna turn. This will make a good Twitter clip, though, when I eventually beat it. Thank you so much, Silsa. I really appreciate you enjoying my fashion sense. I knew you would be able to appreciate this, you know? You're the type who gets this. I hate being so close and not getting, like, hits. I almost saved that. Oh god, the change of direction is killing me on that last Goomba. I cannot go by sight. It has to be a memorization that he is going to be right. Quoggles? No, they're not quoggles. They look like goggles, but they're just regular sunglasses that have really big frames. See, like, regular. All my friends left me. I'm also a little worried that this makeup won't come off the way, because I was trying to take it off earlier, off my hand earlier. And let's just say it was not easy. Um, I don't know what I bought. And I do not have like makeup remover or anything like that. I have no, I have nothing. I have shampoo and soap. Uh, I've got some baking soda, if that somehow helps. That section is horrible. That section is terrible. Not that it should be changed. This is, you know, 1-1 one, one but Goombas. That's, that's the gimmick. It's allowed to be terrible because it's 1-1. One, one. It's You're not mad at the gimmick, you're mad at 1-1 one, one for put, making the gimmick hurt you. Do I have hands? Of course. Worst case scenario is my coworkers compliment me. I don't see that happening. I know John might think it's kind of funny. I don't think he'd compliment me exactly. I was trying to land on the Goomba below. I didn't even think about that one. I should have though.
really hate that island. It's the worst island. Once The one time we got past it, we did good. We did really good. That guy right there, he is so frustratingly, like, not close to the area I'm trying to aim for. I mean, we've, we've clearly made progress because we're getting, like, further each time. Or at least, well, we get to the, the farther part every time now. And then we die to the same crap. That, yeah. Rathcat! Universe Silsa, how long is that name gonna last? When do we get real Silsa back? Or Salsa? <sighs> Look at that, you can see the two Goombas, they're side by side, how do you thread that? I wasn't expecting to land that way. It would be nice to just go under that section, but I think that's not going to be as consistent. Seven days? Wow. Uh... Put more of the makeup on, and then remove with a dry cloth? Whoa, I would not have expected dry cloth. Jesus Christ, I hate chasing the moving right guy down. I saw that there was just going to be a gap there. And I tried to move left, but you can't move left once you start moving right. Unless you, like, come to a full stop. I don't want him to move right. That, that platform needs to be a little bigger. Hate him. I hate him. <laughs> Laughing as I silently die. Inside. Not in the game. I'm already dead here. Seriously? Just move, Goomba. Get under me. Just get under me. Ugh, oh, there's nowhere to go if you go that fast. It really is meant for you to kind of slow down a bit. See what I mean? I can't hit the ones on the left edges. And with this level the way it is, that everything is going to hit a left edge, like, pretty frequently. <laughs> I thought that one was turning around faster. You can't see the the edge of the thing where they're going to turn around once they're covering it. And I have to look so hard at the Goombas that I'm landing on, I can't prepare for like the next jump. I was trying to land on the one that just turned left. God. 
He is so hard to hit. The guy, the Goomba on the one track. I hate him so much. I hate that one Goomba. He is worse than every other Goomba in this stage. That guy's not great. I mean, he's on a one track as well, but at least, you know, he's early in the level. Is that another Kanga ult? Definitely a Kanga ult. <laughs> Kanga, you've just you've established too much of a pattern. I can't believe that didn't make it. I would say hit the one Goomba on the one track in the middle to allow you to get the one on the upper platform. I mean, I can't really aim it. I have to hit it when, when I get there. Couldn't quite make it there. Whoa. Hey, Paldry, what's going on? God, I need to stop looking at chat too. This is this is actually a level I need to look here at, but the, the moving chat is a little bit. This is a discipline problem. if I hit something by accident in that fashion. There are certain ways you can hit them by accident where you go... you can make a recovery. Sometimes you can't. Ugh! Oh. I had to go that far. I had to, or else I was gonna miss the gap. But then I was right under him. And then it's hard to hit that one. There's a level in search for salmon like that? Jesus. Ah, oh, I was over where he was gonna go, but the the turnaround is so awkward. I hate to keep saying that, but it's really, really screwing with me. I had nowhere to go but a full jump. And the full jump just didn't quite make it there. Hey, cat. What's going on, buddy? You're being cute.
Ah. Oh. <laughs> Awkward. I wanted to land on him. He was just too slow. They change directions at like a faster speed than they crawl. It's very strange. I couldn't hit any of them. I was just holding right and you just can't get the momentum back if you jump straight up. I couldn't keep my eyes on the screen, that was weird. I mean, it just blurred out. I saw that I was gonna hit him. I couldn't change direction to stomp him. There was just nowhere to go. There's not, there's no adjusting in this level. You have to have a very purposeful jump everywhere you go. Every jump has a very specific trajectory it's gonna have to take. That one would have been fine. I think it would have been okay. I just needed to not panic when I got further than I've been mostly. Not panicking is hard. Oh, another one on the backtrack. Well, I wouldn't say so close, but it was definitely pretty far compared to, you know, where we've been getting. The problem is definitely, too, that in other games, you can kind of come in from the side and it gives you more like options as to how you're gonna hit things. This game is very, you gotta hit it on the head. But when we get past say like the 40% mark, our chance of getting to the 70 is like really high. It's just that there's still that part in the middle that's incredibly inconsistent for me. I'm not saying it's inconsistent in general, I'm saying it's inconsistent in how I'm getting to it. I just wish that Mario changed direction a little faster in this game. Because sometimes you just want to go left a little bit. And you can't really do that if you're going forward. Unless you slow down really good beforehand. Oof. Right at an edge again. I thought I was going to land on him like he's going to go a little further down the track, but there's no further. I wish the track was more, like, visible. Oh! I should have just hit the next triangle. That was close. Really? I would have quit this level, by the way, if it weren't fun. This is uh, this is beyond the time an unfun level would be at played. <laughs> I 
I'm definitely like screwing myself over a lot though trying to like check chat and stuff. Whenever there's like an awkward pause, I like I start checking more. Cause I'm like, oh when's the next thing somebody's gonna say? Nah, I knew that was gonna wasn't gonna make it either. The triangles are supposed to be little stars. I don't remember little stars. One might say. One might say. You know what's weirder? People who don't dress like mimes on Thursdays. I and mean, who are those people? I can. I mean, I'm definitely getting a lot closer. Oh, I thought I could make it to the pipe, but I came down too straight. I was just too straight for that. A lot of hits there I didn't mean to take. They were just... Soraya! Thank you so much for that tier 1 resubscription for 14 months. Who am I? I am... Actually, I don't think we've made a fun nickname for Mime Jabbin yet. Like, Flappy Jabbin was the Clown Jabbin. I don't know what the Mime Jabbin is going to be. Kanga's usually in charge of that. Try to land on one of the lower ones. Bad choice. Marcel de Jabin. I like that. That's a pretty good one. I'm st I still want someone to make the uh, the Smash Bros. character select with just like a bunch of different gems. You'll have to start with like the N64 Smash Bros. because obviously there's not that many gems yet. But we do have a reward that you can get by earning Java Bucks just by watching. Um, just by watching the stream, you earn them. Or when you pay bits in increments of more than 100, you get Java Bucks. And you can redeem those for me playing other games or um, or doing silly stuff like wearing costumes and stuff like that. Or if you just want me to follow you, you on Twitter or Twitch or whatever. Whatever you want, really. Gosh. I had a system and I just like broke it. Forest Kitty, thank you so much for those fifth or fifteen months, fourteen streaks. So you signed up for my channel at some point stopped signing up, and then you signed back up and were like, alright, we're keeping it this time. I bet you were gifted the first time. That's probably what did it. 
How you doing, Forest Kitty? You having a good day? Good Forest Kitty day? Can't wait to see you in like two weeks. It's almost then. Out of curiosity, I don't know if I told you this, but I was looking up, um... Oh, thank you. I was looking up breweries in, uh, in, uh, Utah. All of Utah, the whole state. Just to see if there was something cool I could take you guys to, you know, while I'm there. And, uh, I found out that Utah is literally the only one that exists. It is the only brewery in the whole state. I don't know how they got that honor. But it's, it's funny, too, because I've had Unitah in Richmond, like, at Tap Takeovers, which is incredible. Like, we just, you have one brewery, and they were like, all right, let's have Richmond have some. I don't know why. That was... I was not ready to land on that guy at low velocity. I thought I was going to arc more. Ah! I was like, alright, there's a place I can land, but after I landed there, there was nowhere else to go. Go, Jabin, go! Go, Jabin, go! Oh, cat's crying. Buddy! Stop it! <laughs> or come up here. You can come up here and get pets. Whatever you need. My hands are getting tired. I messed him up. He always does this, though. <laughs> Are you saying I hurt him every day? <laughs> You're a terrible cat owner, Gem. Seriously? Did my did I do my own mind makeup? Yes, I did. I did it with a sponge. My face was sponge worthy. He does. I mean, every time he cries, it's very distracting because I just, I feel so, I feel pain when he, when he does that cry because it sounds like he's being hurt, which I don't think is true because he does it far too often. He can't be in pain all the time, you know? That would just be nuts. I even waited! Wasn't that quite a triumph of the human spirit? We almost made it. Oh my god. It's like, I want to take this off, but I look ridiculous without the glasses because of the way the lights shine on me. But the the sunglasses have halos in them. <laughs> I know you did. I waited. Didn't you see? I was like trying to avoid them. I just barely mi or hit the guy. I was going to go. I was trying to go over him, but... He was just a little too, uh, in the way. Goombad.
Wow, I can't believe that worked. Oh my god. Don't speak, Jabs. Mime it. Oof. You would try to go faster, really? They were they were all at the top though and coming down. Or are you saying go faster and hit lower? Cause that's popsicle. From what I saw, that's popsicle. Wow, I almost made that. I'm surprised. That might give me more chances if I can figure out how to do that every time. Like if I found a route where I could just go forward and really hard. Go faster and hit lower. Interesting. I keep doing that now. It's like, what am I expecting to hit there? What am I doing? Whoa, why are they all going this way? Ugh. There was nowhere to go. Buddy, come up here. If you're being tortured by Zoraki or something. Yeah, it is pretty ridiculous. I do enjoy it though. I like the idea. And I feel like it's going to be a satisfying finish when I get it. It was a very unsatisfying nigh though. Oh, I just needed to hit that. <laughs> that sounded weird. Don't clip that. hands are getting tired. Although this controller is more comfortable than my last one. It still has limits. Hey, Puds. You gonna stop crying now that you're here? You're a little cat. You're a little cat. Yes! Mimed! GG. Yeah, that was a lot of fun. Oh, thank you for... <laughs> I like how I never even pulled this into my queue. I just started playing it. One. There we go. We did it. Icons is up next. Oh, I forgot to like it. Holy cat baskets. We can still do this. We can still do this. There we go. Phew. Crisis averted.